Are you interested in and are looking for a wireless router? You can check out the Airlit SUS wireless router RTBE88U. This comes directly from ASUS.com. Now at the time of this video creation the price is $350. $350. It's an extendable router. The ASUS model RTBE88U. Dual band supports Wi-Fi 7 has a mesh extendable technology let's see dual 10 gigabit ports four two and a half gig ports and four one gigabits per second ports supports 34 wireless area network local area network capacity and it does support virtual private networks supports Wi-Fi 7 throughput up to 7,000 the number 7 7,200 megabits per second 34 gig with one cutting edge blah 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 it does support wireless area networks and local area networks with I think a standard 10 gigabit port it does have artificial intelligence capabilities for wireless area network detection it has a universal serial bus port so that you can tether with mobile devices so you can actually tether with a mobile device it includes a quad core microprocessor 2.6 gigahertz it is 64 bit central processing unit it supports up to five subscriber set identifiers and even instant virtual private network connections it does include parental controls all you have to do is click one tap for security scanning it does support virtual private network and even site-to-site -site virtual private networks and it has iMesh technology I'm gonna cut to the chase and just skip the marketing and sales fluff and go to the technical specifications remember the router is three hundred and fifty dollars at the time of this video creation but that could obviously fluctuate the price the R2D2 I mean the R2BE88U model it supports 802.11a, 802.11b, 802.11g, 802.11a 802.11ac, 802.11ax and 802.11be it supports internet protocol version 4 Internet protocol version 6, most most common surfs. Residential customers aren't going to use Internet protocol version 6. Product segment, 1376 plus 5,764 megabits per second. The data rate, it supports 7, Wi-Fi 7, which is 802.11be, the long range band, 2.4 gigahertz, up to 1,376 megabits per second the low range band 5 gigahertz but that has more bandwidth up to 5764 megabits per second it depends on your signal though you know you may not get those that bandwidth even in perfect conditions and then it does depend on your signal whether or not you get those that type of bandwidth or get in or near close to that and the antenna includes an external antenna four of them the 2.4 gigahertz 4x4 transmission reception 5 gigahertz also 4x4 transmission reception the microprocessor is a 2.6 gigahertz quad core processor it includes 256 megabytes of flash and 2 gigabytes of random access memory boost speed orthogonal orthodontist I mean <laughs> orthogonal frequency division multiple access okay most people aren't going to care and they don't need to know that information but it is on screen the 20 to 160 megahertz bandwidth it operates in 2.4 gigahertz which is a longer range wireless band and a lower range 5 gigahertz operating mode it has what five different operating modes a wireless router mode an iMesh node mode, an access point mode, 
a media bridge mode and a repeater mode so what that means is most likely in the software you go in there and you can change the wireless router from wireless to I'm node to access point to media to repeater mode and you have to know what you're doing so you might not wanna and I never get advice and never guarantee in that and never recommend anything I probably shouldn't even go over the different modes because if you don't know what those modes deal with then you know I digress back to this this video when in doubt just don't mess around with settings you don't understand okay input output ports 10 gigabits per second for wireless area network local area network 1 10 gigabits per second for wireless wide area network so a little bit of difference in the bandwidth 1 2.5 gigabits per second bandwidth for wide area network local area network so that one like could be a combo you choose one or the other it sounds like 3 2.5 gigabits per second for local area networks and four RJ45 that are looks like that they are they automatically detect either 10, 100, or 1,000 megabits per second for wide area network local area network usage and one universal serial bus 3.2 generation one. Remember that is for tethering to mobile devices or tethering with mobile devices. I've got a minute and a half buttons, a Wi-Fi protected setup button. A reset button and a power switch. Hey, that's, that's, yeah, well, this router is what, 380? 300? Yeah, $350, $350. And it actually has a power switch, power on off switch. Now, the Wi Fi, the WPS button is the acronym which stands for Wi Fi Protect Setup. What that allows you to do is you could set up a printer or other devices. You just press that button. Now that other device has to support Wi-Fi per second setup, but it can make it real easy. You don't have to load software. They, the two will communicate together and they'll configure it. Like an example, a printer. You press the, the Wi-Fi per second setup button, the printer d detects it, the signal, then they communicate together and then bam, it, the, then the, the printer is connected to the wireless router so you can print from a computer that's on the same network. Okay, I digress local excuse me light emitting diode indicator a wireless area network a 10 gig wireless area network a the other 10 gig the port and then the local area network and then the universal serial bus 3.2 the 2.4 gigahertz and the 5 gigahertz and a power so those are the light emitting diode indicators quite a few I think that is this video oh you know what quickly yeah, standard active current, 110 volt direct current, AC, DC active current, direct current. That's that's normal. I mean the the 110 volt to 240 volt, 60 hertz. But the current and yeah, 19.5 volts. Anyways, the pa package content. If you were to purchase this directly from ASUS for three hundred and fifty dollars, this router, you would receive. And RT, R2D2, I mean, RTBE88U model Wi Fi router, a RJ45 cable, which is an Ethernet cable, it's the thicker cable that you use for net, computer networking, a power adapter, a quick start guide, and a warranty card. That is this video pertaining to this. Yeah, it's not the best image, but that'll do for now. ASUS Wireless Router Model RTBE88U. Adios!